Happy day 23. Good morning, time for some cocoa. From my 12 days of cocoa calendar, we've got peppermint cocoa today. Extra festive. Today I'm using my adorable polar bear, smaller like espresso mug. It's from Starbucks from years past, but it's so cute. And this morning feels like a whipped cream kind of morning. <laughs> Cheers. Ooh, it's like very faintly peppermint. It's not too strong. I like it. I'm wearing one of the Too Faced new lip oil gloss duos. What are these called? Kissing lips, I think. Kissing, kissing jelly gloss. And this is in sour watermelon. It smells like a watermelon Jolly Rancher. And it's actually really pretty. Um, it's the first time I'm wearing this color. So I thought I would share it with you. And right now I just got ready. I'm going to get dressed to go and meet my friend Jackie. Um, we've been friends since college. She moved away um, years ago, so I don't see her that often because of that, but she's visiting family for Christmas. So I get to go and have coffee with her and I'm gonna take her to the Decadent Macaroon, that cute shop, that cute coffee and macaroon shop I showed you guys back in the fall, but I know that they decorated really cute for Christmas, so I can't wait to share that with you too. <music> is a holiday cheer latte and it definitely looks like holiday cheer and then my little snowman macaron is I think he said what do you say cake batter I think yeah. so cute Good girl. Bring the toy, bring the toy. Good girl. My favorite inflatable of the neighborhood every year, Rudolph, so cute. I love him. His nose glows even. Okay, I'm back home now, but I realized I didn't show you my outfit of the day that I went out in, and it was so cozy and warm for me today. It was like high of 60 today, so it was on the colder side. Lately, it's been like high 70s, which very disappointing for December. So today actually felt like Christmas time, and I got to wear my cozy Barefoot Dreams new cardigan and it's so soft and has pockets, which I love. And then I just have this um, like stretchy fabric, turtleneck top that I think is from Amazon and then just some jeans. Now I have slippers on. <laughs> and then I have my snowman earrings on again because I love them so much. And then this headband's from Amazon too. Okay, enough about that. Now it's time to do some more Christmas baking. I'm gonna make hot cocoa cookies this is a new recipe for me, not something that I make every year, like the other two cookies that you saw during Vlogmas. Um, so we're gonna try something new and hopefully they turn out yummy. And I'm gonna obviously tell you guys the recipe too. I'm gonna watch It's a Wonderful Life because I haven't watched that yet for one of my Christmas movies. And then I need to finish wrapping the presents because there were a couple items that I had to print 
something to put in my family's packages so I couldn't finish wrapping last night. So I've got to do that too. So we're going to be busy. And I still have the Too Faced Sour Watermelon Lip Oil on. Love it. On the 10th day of cake pops. <laughs> this is salted caramel today. Oh, wow. It really does taste like it. So good. Also, it was so nice to meet up with Jackie. And actually, I got to see my friend Brian, too, who is her husband, but also my friend because we were all like friends in college before they got married. It's And it's really fun. It just was really fun to get to see them both and yeah, and just catch up. And also she was super sweet and gave me a gift. So let me show you what she got me. So it's from um, Los Poblanos Lavender Farm and it's all organic and there's like lavender salt in here, a mist, a candle, and then like a salve, which I, it smells amazing. Like the aroma is just coming right out of the package right now. It smells so, so good. And I love putting lavender mist like on my pillow. Let's see, it's an essential oil. Or just like on my bed sheets. Just so relaxing, the smell. So thanks so much, Jackie. So Christmas movie of the night is The Holiday. I think I did watch this early in the season already too, but it's one of my favorites, so not surprising. I want to watch it again. I was watching It's a Wonderful Life, but I just wasn't in the mood. So I'm changing it. I'm in the mood for something a little more upbeat. Sometimes It's a Wonderful Life makes me too sad. Anybody else? <laughs> it's a beautiful movie. Don't get me wrong. And I'm also going to be doing a little bit of editing before I start the cookies. I'm just not feeling like um, not feeling like baking quite yet. Oh, the music on this film is just so beautiful. Okay, I'm gonna cream together three fourths of a cup unsalted butter at room temperature and three fourths of a cup white sugar and three fourths of a cup of light brown sugar. And just make sure to whip that all together till it's nice and light and fluffy. And now putting two eggs and two teaspoons of vanilla extract to the sugar mixture. Okay, I've got all my dry ingredients in a separate bowl, two cups flour, two thirds cup cocoa powder, a half a teaspoon of salt, and one teaspoon of baking soda. And we're going to slowly incorporate this into our wet ingredients already. And here's what your dough should look like. This is before the oven. This is after eight minutes. And you're going to put a marshmallow half in the center of each one and then bake them for another minute to let the marshmallow melt. I came back over here and look who's cuddled in the blankets. Are you so cozy?